Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Thank you for watching this video. For today, I will present about question maxim and the relation to humor or joke. I make this video to fulfill the pragmatic midterm test. Before I start the presentation, let me introduce myself. My name is Mutia Ulya Kristi. I am from 7A English Education Department. For the first, this is the definition of maxim. This principle are a collection of maxim proposed by Paul Grace in 1975 is also known as the maxim of conversation. Christian maxim is described principle that people intuitively follow in order to guide their conversation in order to make their communicative effort effective. The meaning of a given utterance is the totality of its implicator to the mutual knowledge of the speaker and the hearer in the relation to cooperative principle. There are four main maxims, which revolve around the quality, quantity, relation, and manner. For the first is maxim of quality. Do not say what you believe to be false and do not say what you lack evidence for. In this maxim of quality, we must be truthful. For the second is maxim of quantity. Make your contribution as the informative as required in the circumstance of the exchange. Do not make your contribution more informative than is required. In this maxim, we must be informative as much as possible. And then for the third is maxim of relation. Make sure that all the information you provide is relevant to the current exchange. Omit irrelevant information. In this maxim of relation, we must be relevant in our conversation. And then for the last is maxim of manner. Avoid obscurity of expression, avoid ambiguity, be brave, and be orderly. In this maxim of manner, we must be clear when we give the information for the other when we make the conversation. And this is the definition of humor or joke. Humor is one form of funny game that can be laughable or amused for those who hear or who see it. Humor is a means of communication that convey information, express pleasure, anger, noise, and sympathy. As a means of communication, if humor is used appropriately, humor can function variously. In the show, Comica, or people who perform stand-up comedy with the technique of delivering humor, stories, or joke in a one-liner or story. It consists of several sentences, usually two or three short sentences consists of several premises. This premise consists of setup and punchline. Setup is a premise that is an expression of a situation that can be accepted by audience or a phenomenon of daily habit. The punchline is the part that creates the cuteness of the premise. Previously, by breaking the concept of the premise of the previous setup by other premise that are opposite or not in line with the premise of the setup. So what is the relation between Gracian Maxim and humor joke? And so sorry, after this, I will explain with Max in Bahasa. The main purpose of the comic is to entertain the audience by displaying jokes intelligently. Material submit, or it is usually in accordance with the theme and has been conceptualized. When people throw a joke in stand-up comedy, some people will laugh out, but some people put a stiff face. There are several possibilities that do not understand why it can happen if the listener does not approve of what they hear. Yang saya akan jelaskan di sini bagaimana para audiens bisa tertawa saat komika atau stand up comedy liner itu memberikan sebuah materi. Di sini para audiens itu paham akan materi yang sudah dijelaskan atau diberikan oleh komika tersebut. Ada juga beberapa orang yang tidak bisa mengerti atau tidak bisa paham dan tidak setuju dengan 
dengan isi dari materi yang sudah dipaparkan tersebut itu kenapa ada orang yang bisa langsung tertawa ada juga yang hanya memberikan ekspresi yang datar atau tidak menyukai isi dari materi tersebut nah apa hubungannya dengan Gresian Maxim yang sudah saya jelaskan tadi memang seseorang itu harus e, berbicara dengan menggunakan Maxim yang sudah ada tadi seperti Maxim quality, quantity, manner, dan relevan tapi di dalam halnya sebuah stand up comedy ada beberapa hal yang tidak bisa diikuti karena mengambil hal lucunya tersebut contohnya in term of maximum quality speech from the speaker should be in accordance with reality and deeds and existence of strong evidence preciously that i call speech in stand up comedy violence the maximum of quality because it create humor from illogical thing and it's not necessary follow by evidence that leads of facts for example lo tahu nggak betapa gedenya Grand Indonesia ada yang pernah ke sana gua terakhir ke sana ada mayat turis bawa peta di dalam maximum quality ini seharusnya komika itu memberikan hal yang real dan tidak dibuat-buat serta melebih-lebihkan ada maxim of quantity the narrative of a thing must contribute factually or as much as the person who listen speech in this comedy sometimes that does not contain answer that really needed on deliver excessively this can be said to violate the maxim of quantity For example, gue pernah ketemu sama satu cewek nih ya. Pas ketemu sama dia tuh alisnya tebal banget. Itu kayak bungkus sushi tau gak? Kayak begitu, sumpah. Gue bukannya naksir, bawaannya pas ngelihat alis dia jadi lapar. Terus gue pengen kasih nasi. Terus mukanya gue gulung. Di maxim of quantity ini, hal itu tidak memberikan hal yang informatif. Kenapa? Karena dia lebih-lebihkan satu hal. Seperti tadi, walaupun dia melihat cewek itu alisnya tebal, seharusnya dia tidak memberikan informasi yang berlebih-lebihan. Memasukkan hal yang kurang baik dalam percakapan yang sedang mereka bicarakan. And then the third is in term of relevance, speaker should make a relevant contribution to the issue being discussed. This violation occur when in a speech There is no relevant contribution to a topic that is being spoken. For example, kamu kemana aja nggak kabarin aku? Kata cowok, HP aku rusak. Kata cewek, kamu jahat sambil menangis. Kenapa ini menurut saya tidak relevan? Karena seharusnya siapa yang menangis di sini? Menurut saya ini nggak relevan karena halnya itu tidak nyambung pembicaraan di sini. Tetapi walaupun ini tidak relevan, ada beberapa orang yang bisa tertawa karena hal ini. For the last, in term of maxim manner, here is required to speak directly, not vague, unambiguous, excessive, and direct. But sometimes it's the speaker speaking the opposite and lacking a bad word. For example, terus gua yang nanti makan masakan dia kan, itu dari baunya aja satu gajah dewasa bisa mati deh. Tapi pacar gue sosokan nyuapin gitu. For the last, ada beberapa komika yang sengaja melanggar maxim of manner tersebut karena ingin memberikan hal yang lucu di dalam materinya di mereka. Tapi, kembali lagi, ada beberapa pemahaman dari audiens tentang maxim of manner yang menurut mereka itu hal yang lucu dan tidak apa-apa jika dimasukkan di stand up comedy. I think enough for my presentation today. Thank you for being listening and so sorry for many mistake. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.